Hey guys, it's March 2nd on a Saturday morning and I came down to the storage and I've been piling stuff up that I've gotten listed and boxed here on the table for the last week or so. I had about 20 some items. I kind of need to do some more listing, but I'm getting better. Anyway, I've uh, got those all boxed up uh, at the house and um, got a, when I did the listings, I uh, just left the, of course I didn't have a location, so I brought them down here and I'd do these labels. I just print off about a 50 or 100 of them at a time and leave them down here with my massive scissors. And come down here and I grab the box and I put the actual description that I wrote into the uh, listing on it with a Sharpie. And that way it just, I get a chance to look at the listing again and make sure I didn't put anything stupid on there. And, then I can also change it. I'll bring my iPad down here with me and uh, I can get good signal here and actually work on the iPad. It's, it's fairly fast. So I just pull up stuff on it and uh, I can look at the, what I've called it in there and like 1997 chronology card game for all time history of trivia trivia puzzle i'll write that on the box just so i won't get confused on the on getting the right thing to the right people it's a little overkill but it's worked really well so far i've just had two recently that screwed up and it was expensive but i think i got everybody happy um yeah, I'll show you around here a little bit. You've probably seen this. It's nothing fantastic. It's just a storage unit. Um, let's see. Yeah. Okay, I got it swapped around to the rear mic where it won't sound weird, um, hopefully. So I've got this. This was, this was intended to be like to put stuff on before I list it, but it's probably going to end up just being... being uh, more storage. I've got 210 items. I've got the majority of the bigger boxed ones over here. And then I've got one, two, three, six, nine. I've got 10 totes here, just lettered and uh, one at the house. So that's where my little stuff goes. Anything that I can fit in there. And I try to keep the heavier stuff on the shelf here. These are record uh, sleeves. Got to get around to getting some of those things rolled out of here. That's my Jason case and uh, another case for my iMac. They're overkill, but I can carry it everywhere. And so this is the one that I'm working out of mostly. And then this one is my storage garage bubble wrap all the way back in the corner there. I just bought some more because I thought I was out and I had like one little one and two big ones. So I brought the rest of it down here. Uh, some of this stuff's going to have to go Facebook Marketplace and I've just been lazy about getting it done like this golf boy thing here bag boy and then i've got some really nice uh suitcases i think they're in the van but travel season coming up they'll probably sell so these storage units are 10 by 15 so 150 square feet each so i've got the two of them right side by side so it's 300 square feet and it cost me 206 dollars a month which is a little bit cheaper than what I was paying per square foot at the other place for a 40 foot when I was paying almost 400 bucks a month for it or over 400 bucks a month for it. It wasn't even conditioned. This one's conditioned and it's on third floor, which is no big deal. And pretty happy with it so far. Yeah, there's one of those high dollar suitcases. I thought it was in the van. It's a, to me, it's a good name. If you've dug around with that. And this is one of those silly little pageant cases. I don't remember what they call them. For like the, it's got a little, uh, you open it up and it's got a 
like a thing comes up you can hang dresses or whatever on dance equipment dance costumes so that's pretty neat it ought to sell pretty good brand new they're like five or six hundred i think i'm seeing new used ones going for a couple hundred um <laughs> can't have can't work without my jbl it's kind of creepy up here if you're by yourself like here's somebody back in, on the that next row over now is moving in but a lot of times it's uh just me up here and it's kind of kind of cringy <laughs> so tons of records there i'm just trying to get work on everything as i come to it and hope it'll hope it'll thin out pretty quick and be ready to be going down the road it's a pretty decent storage unit it's uh fairly new it's got these weird locks on it like ace tumblers it's got to be closed and that little tumbler just slides in there so yeah i got that done for the day i'm gonna go head back to the house and get some more stuff listed and um see if i can get something going that is a uh, heated rv hose i thought i might use it for a while but i'm gonna list that dude and it's gonna go away so that'll be easy to list and reasonably good timing i should have sold it a couple of months ago but i didn't so yeah there's my little camera bag I've gone through about 10 camera bags, maybe not quite that many, but I'll find one and I'll kind of like it and use it for a while and I'll find one I like better. And I'll use it for a while. So anyway, I'm headed back down to the house and this is kind of a start of my little project to try to move some more stuff through here a little faster, get things thinned out. So thanks for dropping by.